welcome back to my channel for today's video i'll be doing a tag video i know it's been a while since i did one. i believe the last time i did a tag video was last month and yeah so nobody tagged me on this video and i just decided to do it myself because i find it really interesting and i saw this tag video on katrina reyes um channel i will link her channel down below so you guys could check her out she does amazing um, makeup tutorials and she's really pretty so let's yeah. go ahead and get on to the tag first question best packaging. packaging that i have so far in my opinion is this anastasia beverly hills um artist palette this is my first anastasia beverly hills um makeup ever and i am so happy that i purchased this because i don't know i just love colorful makeup eyeshadows and yeah so i picked this one it looks like inside it has a good size of mirror and 12 eyeshadows and i already did a review about this on my blog and i will link that in the description box if you guys are interested so this is what second question was best color pay Murphy brushes in 35b this is my best color payoff so far because it has a lot of colorful eyeshadows and all of them are very pigmented especially the blue ones the greens and the pinks and oranges they are so pigmented i'm telling you just for example this blue one right here look at that it's so pigmented I use this um uh eyeshadow right here on my alice in wonderland makeup tutorial i will link that video on the description box as well if you guys are interested to see it so yeah this is my best color favorite number three the question was uh, most versatile diva makeup queen palette is the most versatile palette i've ever owned. all her eyeshadows are very pink got a good mirror right here and oh my god just look at that I have a review about this palette also on my channel and if you guys are interested i will also link the video in the description box so you guys could watch it if you still haven't seen it so yeah so best for travel my best um palette for traveling is this that's heart palette it's just very cute very girly and so sleek also it this one's from beige cosmetics has a bronzer already a blush and a highlighter and a neutral eyeshadows they're a bit shimmery and some colorful eyeshadows that you can choose so yeah and the next one is biggest regret so i would say that my biggest regret is this little black beauty book night edition from L. colorful but some of them are just not really pigmented you really have to build up the color to be able to get that um color payoff that you need so mm, this is my biggest regret though but i love using the gold ones right here the yellow ones and orange although i really just have to build up the color that's the only problem i have on this Next palette. question is best color name Anastasia beverly hills it's because it has a Dusty rose aubergine anaconda unicorn which is i like and punch fuchsia buttery orange you fancy beachly blue velvet and coal and fresh this is the best color next name. one is um least used um, i would say that this palette right here this one is from pro fusion cosmetics so this is my least used palette it's just because they're all shimmery i just hope that they came with um mixed with matte eyeshadows but they're not they're all shimmery and it comes in with this lip lip gloss thing and a lot of bronzer and blushes you can choose and a bunch of different colors for highlighters yeah this is my least used palette next most used i actually have two most used palette um i use the diva makeup queen palette and it's duty time palette you can tell look at the neutral color the blue green i've been also and using it especially this one right here and this one and that one most love this one <laughs> it's just because it's really cute and the bronzer is just really perfect for my skin the blush is so pink and the neutrals eyeshadows and oh my god it's just it's just everything that you need right here so i like this this is my most love palette lastly 
desert island. At first, I didn't really know what that means, but when I saw Katrina's video, she's saying that a desert island means that a palette that will that you will bring when you go in the desert or something like that. I choose the Diva Makeup Queen palette. It's because it has all the neutrals that you really need for everyday look. You can use the pink as a blush and a highlighter just lilac right here and the neutral as a bronzer also so this is really perfect so that's it for this video guys i hope you enjoy watching um i'm sorry if my hair is so messy i just don't feel like brushing my hair <laughs> i will be tagging some of my friends in the description box so you better check your name yeah. there and i will also show some names right here so you better read it well, please like this video if you enjoyed and subscribe to my channel if you still haven't and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! Alright guys, so this is what the video looks like.